multiple mini-interviews are a new and fairer method of selecting medical students. We have chosen the MMI method because we believe it gives everyone a fairer opportunity to demonstrate the range of skills and attributes they possess, as well as testing their desire to become a caring professional. The activities of the MMI are designed to test both your educational and personal qualities. There are many more applicants per place for medicine and entry is highly competitive for medicine at UCLan. We want to select the best applicants. The MMI will reveal something of your personality and your critical thinking skills. For example, can you make decisions or can you listen to others? The UCLan MMI format involves 10 individual stations, each lasting seven minutes, during which there are two minutes to read about the station and five minutes of interaction with a member of staff. This staff member may be a scientist or clinical teacher. They could also be a patient volunteer or actor. The MMI will see if you can think on your feet rather than provide a rehearsed answer. There is often no correct or ideal answer. During the MMI, you will move from one station to the next until you have completed all 10 stations. In effect, the interview is 70 minutes long. This can seem like a long time, but it gives the school the fairest way to assess if you should be given the opportunity to study medicine above other applicants. At each station, your performance is assessed. The stations are all worth the same amount of marks and your overall total will be calculated and compared to that of other applicants. If you perform poorly in one station, don't be put off as it's only worth a maximum of 10% and you can recover by a much better performance in another station. Ask the assessor if you do not understand the task. However, bear in mind that no immediate feedback will be given on your performance. You are assessed against a range of criteria and also given an overall station performance score. The MMI is difficult to prepare for, but look at the skills and attributes of a doctor from websites such as the General Medical Council and keep up to date with, for example, the Student British Medical Journal or review the types of dilemmas that health professionals have to consider. We will not be testing individual academic subjects as we have already used this information to invite you to the interview but your ability at integrating skills such as critical thinking and decision-making skills will be tested. We have one station to discuss your transferable skills statement. This is a document that you will have completed during your application that details your work or your shadowing experience. The transferable skills statement examines your reflections on being involved in a caring role and the transferable skills that you have gained from this experience that would be useful during training for a career in medicine. The multiple mini interview is time limited. After the seven minutes of an individual station, a bell will sound and you will have to move to the next station. Feedback on your performance at interview is provided after you have been informed whether you have been offered a place on the medicine degree at UCLan. You will be given your numerical score and that of the cohort average. You will be informed of the cutoff score. We hope that you will succeed in demonstrating that you are suitable for a long period of training and the hard work that is needed to become a doctor.